So here, the first thing we're gonna do is search for the battery using our serial number. Uh, it is the last four digits of the battery. So in this case, it is 0204. We will tap, type that in here, Zero, four. Battery is gonna show up. That is the name of the battery with the last four digits of the serial number. When you click on that, your app is gonna connect and the green LED will light up indicating that the app has connected to the battery. Uh, once the app did pick up the battery, you're gonna see that it's gonna show you your voltages. Uh, that's the voltage of the battery at the terminals is going to give you the state of charge this is an estimated state of charge uh, so right now this battery is sitting at 44 percent estimated state of charge it's also going to give you the cycle life of the battery so this battery has only been discharged and charged once so it only has one cycle it is also going to display the temperature the internal temperature of the battery at the cells either in fahrenheit or in Celsius if you just tap on the actual uh, meter. Also, the capacity of the battery is displayed there. Uh, 200 amps is the total capacity of this battery. You're also gonna get the health of the battery, which right now, since this is a new battery, is a perfect health. So another feature is storage mode. Uh, this is a feature that's only available with our latest firmware update. Uh, so this is one feature that you may want to take advantage of if you are letting these batteries sit for uh, longer than three months. You could select storage mode and what this does, it does shut down the BMS of the battery. So now there's no drain on the actual battery. Uh, now this battery is safe for you to leave stored for four to six months before you need to either cycle it once or give it a light charge. So another feature that we have on our Kilovolt IT app is the um, info of the battery, what state the battery is in or what connection you have it. So here you do have the option of selecting whether you want it in a single use. That means this battery is by itself, uh, not connected to any other batteries and not connected to a battery bank. You can select series mode. If you do want to connect these batteries in series up to 48 volts, you can select here in the app. If you want parallel only and you want to add additional batteries in parallel to this, you could select that function here. And if you're trying to mix and match both series and parallels, we also have a configuration there for you. We also have an alerts tab here which this alert, alert tab does notify you of anything that's going on with the battery. So if the battery, for instance, was charging, you will get an indication here that the battery is charging and the charge will be complete. If for any reason there was a surge on this battery and the BMS did shut down the battery for safety features, uh, you will get a warning here that the battery was, uh, there was too much surge placed on the battery. Um, if there is low voltage, you will also get a low voltage alarm here. So any indicators that there's something wrong with the battery, you will receive on this alerts tab. Another tab here is the about us tab. The about us tab is really important. Once you do get your battery, you do have a registration button right there, register my battery, which does direct you back to the kilovolt uh, website. And here you can finish your whole registration of the battery. Uh, easy, it's within a couple of seconds, you'll finish the registration. All right, so now we're gonna go into the pro info screen. Standard password for this screen is one, two, three, four. This screen shows all your cell voltages of the battery. It also gives you uh, any alerts that you may have, high voltage, low voltage, or recurrent. Uh, good indicator of where your battery's state of charge is. So these are some of the advantages of downloading the Kilovolt IT app. You can find the app either in the Google Play Store or the Apple Store.